Imagine a world that has no star to orbit. Scientists speculate that our galaxy is teeming with rogue planets, adrift in the murky lanes of interstellar space. These are orphaned worlds, planets that are booted from their solar systems by the chaos of planetary migration. Astronomers call such worlds planemos. Planemos are planets without a star. They're just drifting through the galaxy indefinitely. What massive force would it take to kick a planet out of the solar system? When a young star forms with a contingent of planets around it, many of those planets gravitationally interact with each other. They yank on each other, slingshot each other, so that one of them is ejected from the planetary system, voted off the island, if you will. If you were, unfortunately, a resident on a planet that was kicked out by a collision or a near collision with another large object, you'd probably rapidly move out of the habitable zone. There are hundreds of billions of these lost, wayward, poor, wandering planets out in our Milky Way galaxy with no parent star to warm them up. Cold dark, quiet. Because planemos have no sun, they are worlds without days or years. They keep vigil through an eternal night. Planemos are solitary wanderers, sentinels of the galaxy. Just because it's out there drifting in space, doesn't mean a planemo is dead. If the planemo is a rocky world, it could well have life on it. A small rocky planemo without an atmosphere will slumber in extreme cold. Far colder than the coldest winter day on our own South Pole. But a planemo large enough to retain an atmosphere traps the heat generated when the planet was first formed. It is the ultimate greenhouse effect. The heat and energy comes from the molten core deep inside the lonely planet. If the planemo is a gas giant like Jupiter, it may have a system of moons. The gravitational pull between the planemo and its moons creates friction causing the interior of the moons to stay warm. These moons could also have life on them, in the same way that Jupiter's moon Io has volcanoes and has a lot of heat energy being generated by interactions with Jupiter and the other moons.